The first known boat to actually navigate underwater was, of course, built by a Dutch dude. Dutch, man, they're just so good at water. 150 years later, over here in what was soon to be the United States, George Washington paid for this sucker to be made for his army, the turtle, because it kind of looked like two turtle shells put together. So cute. The guy in there is just like so cozy. They tried to use the turtle in their war for freedom against the British, but it never really did anything useful, and then it just sank. Cool name, but wasn't a super useful submarine, but it paved the way. 50 years later, we have the American Civil War, where the Confederate rebels built a sub that was powered by a bunch of guys manually turning a crank. And on board, it had a long spar torpedo. Don't be fooled though, spar torpedo was just a fancy way of saying a bomb on a 15 foot stick. And they actually used it. They snuck up on a Yankee ship with their bomb stick in the middle of the Civil War and blew it up and both sides sank. Like the submarine sank too, like it didn't work. I mean, it kind of worked, but didn't really work.